Today we're going to talk about diesel exhaust fluids, or DEF for short. So what exactly is diesel exhaust fluid? Well, it's a liquid that's injected into the exhaust systems of diesel engines in order to reduce harmful NOx emissions. And the way that it does that is it breaks the nitrogen oxides down into harmless nitrogen and water. And it's a liquid that is essentially a combination of urea and water. Uh, and the water that you use, it's important that it be deionized water so that it doesn't contain any minerals. Now let's review exhaust systems. So the US government has implemented regulations on diesel engine exhaust. And in particular, they're concerned with a few different things. Uh, for the purpose of this discussion on diesel exhaust fluid, we're going to mainly focus on the nitrogen dioxides or nitric oxides. Now, as a result of those emissions regulations, the diesel engine manufacturers have introduced various exhaust system components to ensure that, that, uh, that they are able to meet those emissions. So let's review some of what those systems look like. Uh, here's a schematic, and what we're looking at is the diesel engine here. Uh, the first component we're going to focus on is the exhaust gas recirculation, where you're taking some of the hot gas, cooling it down, and reintroducing it to the diesel engine. The diesel particulate filter is uh, scrubbing a lot of the particulate matter before it uh, exits the stack. And then this thing here, this is a selective catalytic reduction unit, and it is removing the uh, nitrous oxides um, in a chemical uh, process, and this diesel exhaust fluid is facilitating that chemical process. So diesel exhaust fluid was first introduced around 2010 as a result of these uh, emissions regulations. Uh, this is a chart showing you how those emissions regulations progressed over time. They continue to get tighter and tighter. And this chart over here, we're looking at the total greenhouse gases uh, in the U.S. in 2018, broken down by industry. Uh, initially, DEF was mainly for on-highway units, but slowly it became uh, also utilized in power generation as well as off-road applications as well. So, DEF... Uh, it, it's important that the DEF have a certain quality standard and that there is some consistency to the fluid. And so there's a standard called ISO 22241-1, which dictates things such as the concentration of urea that must be present, the contamination levels that you want to uh, stay below. That contamination includes both things like dirt as well as metal, as well as minerals from the water, from the source water. Uh, the quality in terms of both the water purity and the type of urea that can be used. Uh, storage materials, because DEF is a corrosive substance, and so it shouldn't really be stored in uh, metal containers, things that may rust. Uh, and finally, handling procedure because of safety considerations.